Hi there everybody, I'm Andy and welcome back to another Let's Play. This one featuring my long lost son who's disappeared for a while, Josh. He insisted. Uh, this video is for a new version of Dungeon Nightmares. When Dungeon Nightmares holds a special place in our heart because it was the very first one that Josh and I decided to start doing together seriously as a Let's Play and it was a scary one for him. Uh, I didn't get scared at all, did I? <laughs> um, this is Dungeon Nightmares 2. This is a demo for the game by K Monkey, and uh, she uh, I, she commented on my videos before and stuff. Now I never finished the first one. I could only get to night five, and you know after a while I got kind of frustrated with it because it starts you all the way at the beginning again every time you die instead of just you know well you know you still got to get through level five here. Huh? It starts you like night one. Yeah, and you got to survive night no, seven nights, and I can only get as far as five. And when you die, it starts you all the way back at night one again, and you still got to get through. It. And it can be very frustrating. My heart can't take it. Well, here we've got Dungeon Nightmares too. I I have not seen this played or a demo. I was messing around on Game Jolt earlier today and and saw Dungeon Nightmares and wondered if she had done an update or something like that and what I saw was, you know, give my Dungeon Nightmares 2 a try. So, I decided I was going to do a Let's Play. I have no idea what's in store. Josh says that the menu already has him freaked out. <laughs> He's already freaked out. Uh, so, we're just going to dive in. And he said, can I come have a heart attack with you? <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? So, we're going to get in here and see what's going on. From what I understand, the controls are still WADSD to move around, uh, B to blow the candle out, C to light the candle, and M for the map. Other than that, don't know. Here we go. Oh, that's kind of loud in my ears. That was loud in yours? Sounds like an alarm. Do, 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 do. Twenty-five November. I guess it accesses your uh, your computer clock uh, to know what your your date is, and because today's the twenty-fifth of November, as a matter of fact. So, and it's one thirty-three too. <laughs> so, but that was a female's voice that was breathing pretty loud, wasn't it, Josh? Yeah. They should call this hotel nightmares. Ooh, we can. We can mess with stuff. Now, if you guys, if none of you... Hang on just a minute, Dad, before you your butt fell off. We'll get it fixed on. Now, if none of you have seen any of our videos for the first Dungeon Nightmares, go check it out. It's scary. The K-Monkey did a really good job with this game, okay? And you can get this game, well, the first one totally for free. At, oh, good. <gasps> Lights instead of just a candle. Yay. How about we just spend the whole game hiding here? You can get the first Dungeon Nightmares for free at GameJolt.com. Uh, you can download it there. There might be a, some other place she has it online. Uh, this is a demo version of this game. I don't think she's quite done with it, but that's okay. We never finished the first one anyway, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. But she did a really good job with the first one, so I'm, I'm kind of wondering is there a way to find out um no do i know do i have any candles thank you <laughs> the radio is creepy the drawers are creepy too oh, who's those drawers man <sighs> Uh, <laughs> um, anything in the trash can? I want my Is it just me, or does... This looks like we're in a motel room, an apartment. And is it just me, or do all the motel room, apartment things in games look the same? I mean, you, I could almost swear this looks like the, a little apartment complex in Portal 2. Seriously. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Why 
What what's that sound? Okay, we want PP. Oh, there's a teddy bear there. Um, why'd that move? Hello? I should leave the bear in case they come back. In case who comes back? And ever since Five Nights at Freddy's, I don't trust teddy bears. I used to like teddy bears. I used to even draw a comic strip about a big old bear. It was like a big old teddy bear. I need a key. I never trusted teddy bears. Teddy bears are so scary. Like, they look like they have teeth. You do not have the key. Okay, I don't have the key. You want to give me the key? Uh -huh. Well, what do we have a key to? See, the first game, there were tons of jump scares. After a while, you get used to some of the jump scares, so they're not so jump scary anymore. Ooh. I am not getting on that. I don't know about you, Josh, but I do not want to get on that. Uh, she needs to work on the triggering area a little bit better. Tell you what, uh, Key Monkey, and I, I don't know if she had anyone helping her. I, I just don't want to go anywhere. Why do we play scary games? Like, why am I playing Outlast? I have much more fun with Kerbal Space Program or Mass Effect. Because it builds character. What? Because it builds character? <laughs> That's the excuse in all the Calvin and Hobbes books. I think the door is stuck. Now this is just a demo, so I have no idea how long it is. Or if there's anything else in here. It, it could be just uh, here. This is kind of the environment you're going to be in. You know, and even without any jump scares, this place is creeping me out, man. It, did I just see something up there? Oh, I hate this darkness. Do I see something? I don't know. You tell me. Do we have a candle? No. How about a map? It looks like we got a flashlight, Wait. but it looks like it's off center. It, Josh is right. It looks like we kind of like we got a flashlight here. Of course, it would make it sense. It did say M for the map. Maybe that part's not been activated yet. It would make sense if it, the flashlight was off to the right because it's in your hand. Okay, well, we can't go anywhere yet. I mean, I can't open any doors. Mm. Well, the walking sensation is good. I don't know about you people, but I don't walk like this. I mean, you know, I, I walk a little bit like this, but I don't walk like this. Maybe you, you might want to change that. Okay. Um, um, what? I don't know if we should go back and check on the teddy bear and see if speak, he needs Speak up. Go back and check on the teddy bear? Yeah, see if he needs a lollipop. I don't like teddy bears, Josh. Told you. Maybe if you give him a lollipop, he'll be nice. Well, where did I get a lollipop? I don't know. Pull one out of your butt. Uh, I don't know. Excuse me. <laughs> Okay, well, it's... I can't met. Oh, my God. I recognize that painting. Do you recognize that painting? <laughs> I'm going to slowly turn around, Josh. <laughs> no, okay, nothing bad happened. Okay. So, uh, is this all that there is to the demo? No. I'm not scared of a long-necked girl that runs at me because if I had a weapon, 
Hmm. Well, we, it doesn't look like we can do anything else. I can't tell. Is there a... Oh! Oh, thank you. Uh, Josh, what would I do without Josh? There's another lamp on the other side of the bed, too. There is? Yeah. See it right there? Oh. Josh was right. I didn't see keys anywhere. Hello? Hello? Hmm. My scary senses are turning on. I'm getting itchies. Your, your scary senses are turning on. Was there a way to turn on a light in here? No, but we can lock ourselves in here. Let's hide in the bathroom. Yeah, we'll hide in the shower that has glass brick walls. Yeah, that that make a lot of sense. Ooh. <laughs> we can turn on the okay, turn it off. We can turn the faucet on. Okay. Well What I wanna know is why did this girl suddenly wake up? I don't know. It's sad that, you know, every uh uh, day you're you're waking up. Um, from a nightmare, screaming. So, okay, good. Now, if this is all there is a demo, this is all there is. Okay, but it's got me really curious. It's got me wondering what it's gonna be like. Like Josh, it does seem like we got a flashlight that's pointed off center. Oh, wait a minute. Well, we can still try getting into that, uh, elevator. elevator. I guess that's the only way to go. Is, was it this way? No, no, I'm lost. I always get lost. You know where the teddy bear was? You go straight down. From up here, turn right. Oh, really? Yeah. How come you remember? Oh, yeah, there it is. Can we go to the, any of these rooms? Uh, uh, that off center flashlight's kind of creeping me out. Okay. So do I, I, I step on it? Ooh. Oh no. Oh no. What have I done, Josh? <laughs> Ooh. Apparently there is more to this. <laughs> now remember, y you, you, yeah. W watch my step down there. You you asked to sit in with me on this. I was perfectly willing to abuse myself I, I, alone. <laughs> I, I wanted to you know, come because I've seen in your videos you need a friend to sit next to you. So. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, it did say that you can light up briefly by doing that. The only problem I see with that... Find the artifact and exit. Oh, just like Dungeon Nightmares 1. Now we're in Dungeon Dungeon. See. <sighs> the only problem, okay, with that, the flash thing. Oh, I'm step on that. While it's cool to quickly light something up. This is some good atmosphere. This is some really good and creepy atmosphere. <laughs> Don't go in the room with the bloody chop chop. Why not? Because you'll get chop chop. All right. Can I see a map now? Oh, there is a map. Um, kind of weird. Yeah. 3D-ish. You need to work on the map a little bit. We can't see it really well. Okay. Oh. Is this going to have pipes bursting out at us? Don't go with the vanish thing, please. Because <laughs> while it's scary a little bit, yeah. It's cheap. Well, I, I don't know. Um. Oh, one more candle went out. Oh, we only get one candle. Only one candle. Oh, just like that, you gotta collect it. Uh, see, the only thing about that flash is when you hit it, you 
know, it then go. It, you see it only briefly, and then everything goes dark. What's up with these valves? You do realize I'm lost already, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. As long as you realize that I'm lost already. Okay. Now in the f the first one. That was in the first one, too. Okay. Apparently. <laughs> Hello? Hello? You, you did a good job with this so far. <laughs> Did I take a candle there? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo, you two? <laughs> oh, yeah. No fair, he took off his earbuds! Oh, okay. My heart's still beating from the steam of Ooh, uh... <gasps> Oh my god, look at that picture! Oh. 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 Excuse me? Hello? I don't like this. Yet for some strange reason, I must keep playing. <laughs> I found paper scrolls of some sort. Oh, good. Candle. Let's get out of here. I don't want to find an artifact. I, I, I just want to... Uh, okay. Alright. So... Here we go! Ooh, more candle. Thank you. Uh, no, no, chains. In the first game, you got this really bloody Mary girl. That's why they kept saying Mary. <laughs> it said, why would someone leave their clothes? Welcome. Me and Josh want to leave. Right, Josh? Me and Josh want to leave. Maybe not through that door, though. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> uh. Oh. But yeah, you had this girl in bloody bandages. Ch Wait a minute. Did I get turned around? Was I here already? Oh, oh, okay, I'm just, I'm a little confused, that's all it is. Room 307, room 307, room 307, room 307. Okay. What's with the bloody cups? What's with the what? Bloody cups. Why is that picture turned around? I don't know what's up with the bloody cups. Let's uh, light another candle up. Let's look at the map again real quick. Uh, okay, okay. I see a little bit better. It needs to be up a little bit more so I can, we, we can, we, we can, I am really nervous. <laughs> I'm just waiting for that screaming girl thing to come at us or something. So, um, why is the hook spinning around? Go away. I don't like hooks. Uh, is there any moving skeletons in here? Hello? Hi? Will you be our friend? Me and Josh like making friends. Right, Josh? Right. Right. We just want to give you a lollipop. 
Who left these here? I don't know. Don't know who left them here. We are out of candles. And who was this woman? I don't know who left them here. All I know is that we've been... Oh, wow. We're, we're right back where we started at. This is a good. And it's... We've been playing for 20 minutes, so we're going to have to stop here. Which will be okay. I won't mind stopping. <laughs> Oh no. Remember what the skeletons did before, Josh? Hi, Bob. Hi, Bob. Bob? Bob, is that you? Ooh. I don't know. I don't know. There's another one. I really hope they don't move around or anything. Bill. Bill and Bob. Barry. Barry's, Barry's one that falls apart, remember? Yeah, you got Bill and Bob follow you around, and Barry falls apart if you stare at him too long. Because we're so handsome. Because we're so handsome. Yeah, yeah, there we go. What was this used on? I don't even know what this is. Why would someone leave their clothes here? This is the bag. How does she know? Uh, I don't know, but like I said, we need to stop. I just screamed we can't, Josh. Uh-oh. I did that. Ah! <sighs> okay, that's new. <laughs> oh, it's it's the it's no a room. Room 313 key found. Find the exit. So the artifact was a key to room 313. Now we gotta find the exit. Well, can we just go back to the um, elevator? Yeah? I think. No? <laughs> What's making that noise? Go away. Hey boys, y'all want to help me out here? Tell me where the exit's at, please? Huh? I'll invite you over to Thanksgiving in just a couple of days. There we go. Right? 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 Let's go. Right? Right? No. No. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I don't blame him. I feel the same way. All right, everybody, we're going to stop here because we've been playing for over 20 minutes and stuff like that. And i got to, you know, keep the videos a little bit short and stuff like that. I can't promise we'll do more, but I must say, I'm impressed. It's just a demo, but I am really impressed. This this is on par with the first one. Sh shut up. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, good job. Got me several times. There's a couple like the map. You might want to move it up a little bit and everything. So, but atmosphere, creepiness, jump scares. And we haven't probably hit whatever nasty thing you have in here now. The new thing that goes, <laughs> All right, so we're going to leave you guys here. I hope you're having a great day, a great night, wherever you are out there. Please stay safe. Take care of yourself. And me and Josh will see you in another video. Right, Josh? All right. Love you all. Bye-bye.